is good boys and girls, Zero Braxton. Also, let's start bringing you guys another video, and today we are going to be doing a full length house tour. Not even trolling, you guys always think when I'm trolling. I'm trying to upload more, as you can see. My last video was the Travis Scott event. I hope you guys did enjoy that video. Uh, I'm also sorry if it is echoing in here because it's my bathroom. It's the only room with like decent lighting in my house, so that's why I'm uh, starting my video in here. I hope you guys do go on to enjoy this video and yeah let's get started so this is my bedroom uh you guys don't have to tell me twice i didn't want to clean my room for this video because i am too lazy to do so uh but over here we have a queen size bedroom that is where i sleep i do nothing else on this bed it's where the magic happens hopefully in a couple years you know what i'm saying uh, over there we got my nightstand with a bunch of extra socks on it for me doing my laundry because i am a responsible child on top of my laundry, I have, uh, like, a $20 bill and then a freaking Alexa and a glass of water. Uh, over here, that's my uh, puppy's cage, which I'll get to in a second. There's some random clothes on top of it, if you can see those. I got my desk over there as well. That's where I put, like, all my books. I got my uh, dish thing right there, which is, like, goes up to my TV. It's my router type thing. Got some books right there. Uh, and then, like, a magnet thing that's supposed to keep revolving forever. And then chair right there where I sit to do my schoolwork. And, uh, yeah, on to the next room. Moving on to the guest bedroom, this is like my stepdad's work office type thing. He has a laptop right there and then one of my old mouses that I gave him to do all his like work and finances, manages finances and whatever, that's just an example. Over here we have another queen size bed where obviously our guests would stay because it is called our guest bedroom for a reason. Got a window out there looking over to our pool, which a video is going to be coming out next week. Or this week, actually, because we're going to be opening up the pool. Uh, again, bed right here. We have some extra stuff down there. We're storing stuff in here until people actually stay in this bedroom. Uh, over here is the walk-in closet. I actually... Um, I actually forgot to showcase this in my bedroom, but it has all of my mom's um, extra clothes, my stepdad's extra clothes, and it has even my mom's wedding dress, which is that big white bag right there. I also forgot to showcase my bathroom in the other room, but this is the guest bathroom. Uh, both my bathroom and the guest bathroom basically have the same layout, um, so that's pretty much it. Let's move on to the next room. Moving on to the next room, this is our living room. This is where we watch TV on that TV over there. Uh, it's our, like, dinner table, even though we never eat there. We usually eat at the bar or just sit down when we're feeling lazy at the couch and at the coffee table. But anyways, uh, this is our table. This is my mom's kind of office until she moves down to my office downstairs, which I will also be showing, even though you guys kind of already saw it on my gaming setup tour. Um... Anyways, this is our kitchen, which is kind of linked with the uh, living room, obviously. But we, we got the burners over here. We got a microwave, and then we got a stove. We got this fridge with the freaking water that can come out of it. And I just spilled a little bit of water. I honestly don't really care. Got the sink over there. We got a bunch of freaking storage to store all our appliances, like our forks and stuff. You know what I'm saying? We got the plates in there, uh, glasses in there, paper plates in there, and all the medicine. You know what I'm saying? Uh, over here, we got our pantry. It, it, I could, you could say it has a lot of food. I know. We're, we're kind of fat in this house, okay? I'm sorry. You're going to have to deal with it. Uh, that's pretty much the kitchen and the living room. Let's move on to my parents' bedroom. Moving on to my parents' bedroom, I made sure there's nothing personal that is hanging around in my parents' bedroom. So, Mom, if you're watching this video, which you probably are, I apologize for going into your room, but... We have to for the sake of the viewers, okay? My supporters, if you guys are a supporter. Um, that being the video right now, make sure you guys do like and subscribe. You don't have to. You can stick around to make sure I make good ton content before you guys uh, take any of those steps into action. Let's get into this room. So this room, it's the master bedroom, obviously. It is my parents' room. They got a fire a place right there, like an electrical fireplace. Uh, they're going to be putting a TV stand right here that's going to look over to their bed. Again, this house is relatively new. We haven't we haven't even been living here for about like eight months, not even. But anyways, that is my big dog Foster's bed. And it, uh, their windows also look out onto the pool and they have a door, uh, door access to our outside uh, porch area. And it's super nice here in Michigan. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to be spending a lot of time out there today. Uh, moving on, they also have a queen-size bed. Don't have a king because why not? This is my mom's workout, or <laughs> workout, my mom's makeup type area. You can see me, by the way. It was good. I'm looking hot today. I'm just kidding. I'm trolling, all right? I'm trolling. 
Uh, again, uh, it's my mom's nightstand. She has some water, drinks, and stuff on there. Uh, uh, let's just take this into uh, consideration. She has like a couple hundred dollar bills sitting on her nightstand. We're not rich. I don't know why she has that on her nightstand, but that is my stepdad's nightstand. He has like his gun in there in case one one of y'all idiots decides to break into our house, which hopefully you don't do that, all right? And then there's my dog Foster and the little puppy, rookie, rookie. Let's move on to their bathroom. Now their bathroom kind of be the kind of, this is the area that I was worried about. It's like where all their sensitive stuff would be. That's my stepdad's side, obviously. As you can see, his shaving cream and stuff over there. My mom has her uh, lotion and stuff, uh, concealer and stuff over there. Uh, here we got the bathroom. We got a toilet in here because they have a massive shower, which I'm about to show you. This is their shower. Uh, it literally has three shower heads. So if we all wanted to take a shower in here, we could. My mom has her stuff for taking a shower over here as well as my stepdad does. You guys are about to see the biggest closet in a modern household at, like ever that you will ever see, all right? The audio in here is going to be amazing because it has soundproof walls. Anyways, I'm going to go in here and just introduce it because it's a massive. This is their closet. You, It's literally like my old bedroom in my old house. That is my mom. That is my stepdad. And then a quote right there says, A perfect marriage is two imperfect people who refuse to give up each other. They got married on October 21st, 2017. That is why the date is there. Then they're up there at South Haven, I'm pretty sure. And then there's another picture of them up there. We got some shoes right here. Uh, luxury type. Well, those are luxury shoes. My dad or my stepdad's shirts and stuff up there. My mom's shirts and stuff down here. Got more shirts over here. Uh, shoes, more shoes, hats. Uh, we do live on a farm, kind of, by the way. So that's why there's a bunch of cowboy hats. We do indeed have three horses. Anyways, this is their room. Let's move on to the next one. Now, I want to take a second to interrupt the video. This is going to be like a serious time. Um, I just want to say I hope you guys and your families are staying, uh, staying healthy during this tough time. I might get demonetized if I say what's going on right now, but you all know. I again, I hope you guys are staying healthy. Make sure you're washing your hands, taking the mandatory precautions that you need to. My family is being very cautious about going out and getting groceries even. But even though, like, some of you might not even understand what's going on right now. But it is a really important time, and I just want to wish you guys the best throughout this time. All right, so we'll move on to the next room right now. So this is like our second guest bathroom. As you can see, it's pretty unique. Not only because it has a urinal. Well, that's really the only reason why it's unique, huh? But as you can see, we have a mandatory sink right here. Mandatory mirror. Again, I'm looking sexy today, am I not? We got a picture. Another picture of Colorado. Toilet. Weight scale. Let's actually see how much I weigh real quick so you guys don't think I'm fat. All right, I'm 99.2 pounds, all right, and I'm five foot one, I think. Uh, there's a trash, or 99.2, there's a trash can over there, toilet paper, which we need to put a new one on there, by the way. Got a towel over there for no reason, just to dry our hands off, probably. But yeah, we'll move on to the laundry room, which is literally right next to it. Uh, we have the dogs, or this is Foster's uh, food bowl and water bowl, Rook's, the puppies, uh, water bowl and food bowl, a sink to like just, uh, or. Uh, Hand wash, uh, laundry. Got this like twenty million dollar freaking uh, washer and a twenty through million dollar freaking dryer. I'm obviously trolling. Uh, it looks out onto our yard, and uh, there's our new addition to our uh, driveway, our basketball hoop. Anyways, that is our yard. Uh, there's a bunch of cabinets up here to store like stuff that we put in here, like Tide Pods or uh, fireworks or anything. Not legit fireworks, but like laundry fireworks. Uh, we got some like first aid kits in there and then just random stuff. That is a picture from my mom's wedding that is the uh, maid of honor, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called, and then the best man, and then I'm right there with my little nine-year-old looking head with a bunch of rings on, thinking I'm so cool even though I'm not. Um, but yeah, we'll move on to downstairs, I guess. So this is the downstairs area, as you can see right there. Those are the steps down to here. Our house is only a two-story house, but it is really, really big for a two-story house. I'm not saying we're rich or anything like I have said at the beginning of the video. We are not rich. Uh, we we got um, lucky with this house, right? So over here, we got the pool table. We usually use this when people come over. I can slap some kids up in the pool, you know what I'm saying? 
Over there, we got the, like, 55-inch TV for when we're playing pool and I'm clapping kids' cheeks. We can watch YouTube or Netflix or anything. Tiger King, by the way, Carol Baskin, I freaking hate you. But down there, we got the remotes for the TV. We got the dish thing for, like, if we want to watch cable. We got the pool triangle and the Apple TV right there. And we store our pool sticks right here. Over here, we got the downstairs bathroom, kind of. We got the shower over there, the toilet. This is where we give our dogs baths. Or at least one of our dogs baths. So um, that's pretty much it for over here. Over there we got like a chair and then another chair and then a table that we can put our drinks on. If we're if I'm also also clapping kids' cheeks on this basketball hoop, uh, we got a yoga ball down there for no freaking reason. Uh, this also looks out to our hot tub and pool. Um, again, I'm doing a video this week. Um, uncovering this pool, so it's gonna be super dope. Walking over here, we have a small bar with a bunch of alcoholic beverages that we can make over here, you know what I'm saying? Also, another mirror, which I, I am going to say I'm looking freaking sexy today. I'm just kidding. Anyways, we got a uh, giant Jenga over here. And y yesterday, I managed to freaking twist the whole Jenga tower around, which is kind of funny. Uh, we got a Wi-Fi thing because we have like three or no, we have four Wi-Fi connections things. That is one of them. Like it. It routes throughout the whole house. It's like five gigas or five five gigas, five gigs of internet. Over here we have a homemade couch. We have to put we have to modify it a little bit as you can see, but for right now we're just putting random pillows and stuff on it. We also have another table uh, storage over there, and then this is a really really special to me. It's gonna be really emotional, but uh, my great grandpa who passed away last year. I made a video on this. Uh, this was his cabinet when him and my great grandmother were alive. Uh, rest in peace, Grandpa. I will love you forever. Uh, he was only not er, not only he was really old. He was ninety three. But, um, anyways, that's besides the point. We have a bunch of stuff from our old house up there. That's, like, uh, that little, like, house-looking thingy. That is incense. And I can tell you, it smells really bad, but it, like, refreshes your senses. Just saying. It smells really bad. Over here, we got another 55-inch, I think, TV for when we hear. I'm doing a house tour video because I'm bored. Do you want to be in it? Do you think you look too ugly, which you don't? Because you, you're always self-aware. Yeah. No. I'm just showing people the house. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Anyways, this is where we play, like, obviously Jenga, and we, we can play cup pong or beer pong over here if we want to. This is outdoor access again, so we can walk out. We can go to our hot tub or swimming pool. There's a little bar area over there where we also will put alcoholic beverages. Um, if you guys heard our conversation, please do not break into our house, even though I don't, I didn't link my address. But some of you watching this video know my address because you guys are my friends. So don't leak our address or anything. But moving on to the best part of the house, in my opinion, uh, my gaming setup. I switch, or I modified a couple things. Uh, I moved my mic to my side because I felt like uh, you guys could barely hear me on my streams when um, when my mic was like hanging over my monitor. But this is my gaming setup. Uh, Flaw, my team, the team that I'm in, will be coming on with a new and improved gaming setup tour video. <laughs> I don't know why my voice got squeaky right there. But anyways, this is my mom's desk that she will be working out when she moves down here. It has all her stuff on it. Don't really care. Uh, that is my PC box. That, that beautiful thing came in. Um, we'll do the outro upstairs with my mom. That was my house tour, by the way, guys. See you in a second. Again, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I was just trying to keep the vibes up during quarantine so you guys have something to watch, something to enjoy, uh, some entertainment during this rough time. But again, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I will see you guys in the next one, hopefully in a couple days. Peace out, guys.